Hi, it's Friday and I'm filming vertically because I'm in the car and I don't have a setup for my camera. So um, this is the most comfortable and safest way for me to film at the moment. And um, today's payday, which means it's also bill day. We have a lot of bills to pay. And um, I'm running around. Um, I went to the DMV because our tags need to be renewed today. Also had to go to the post office because Dan has pledged to donate towards our local fire department, which is like really random. So I had to send our pledge in, which is, I mean, I'm all for the fire department, but of all the charities, I just didn't think that would be the one that we would be donating to. And, um... Well, we moved this time last year, like, we moved almost to the day this time last year to America. And we got our apartment, so, um, and we also got a car, so that's why our tags are due today. And our post office is also, the bill is due for that today as well. And um, we have rent due today. And last month, I forgot to pay our Cox bill. I just completely forgot to pay. I've never done that before. Um, I blame it on it being the new year because I threw out my old calendar and it kind of had it clearly um, written where the bills were due and this month I just didn't know when they were due so I forgot. I forgot to pay my Cox bill. So I'm spending a lot of money today. Um, hopefully I'll get to go and meet the husband for lunch. Um, he needs a wallet so I'm thinking about buying him a wallet and filling it up with a bunch of like gift cards and stuff like from his favorite places to eat it's a bit frustrating because he's gluten free now and so that means that a lot of these places that he won't be able to get his favorite things like his favorite place in the world is chick-fil-a because it's like amazing right well who ever heard of going to chick-fil-a and getting grilled chicken that's not what you do at chick-fil-a you get the you get the little chicken nugget things and you know, they're fried and they're delicious, but they're packed full of gluten. So, out of honor for my husband, whenever I go to Chick-fil-A when I'm with him, I get the grilled chicken too. And it's not near as good. So, I don't even know if I'm going to get a gift card from there. But anyways, I want to get him a wallet. And, you know, here's my theory when it comes to presents. People don't really remember that you gave them a present for their birthday or for Christmas. It's kind of expected. You you kind of expect a gift from your spouse. In fact, if you don't get a gift from your spouse, it's a huge letdown if they forget your birthday or forget to get you something for Christmas. But if out of the blue, for no reason at all, you give somebody a gift, that's super, super special, isn't it? So I'm going to get him a card to tell him I love him and get him a wallet, put some gift cards in it, put it in a gift bag and give it to him for lunch today and for no reason and I really think he's going to appreciate it. I think he's going to think that's special. So, um, yeah, I've been a bit of a butthead to him lately for, for no particular reason. It's not for this, it's always for something different all the time, but just been of a butthead. You know, I've been really impatient and I've been really, um, I don't know, easily annoyed, and so I'd like to work on that, I'd like to become a more loving wife, I'd like to become a more caring wife, and and I want to show him that I love him, because he means the world to me, and he's a wonderful, wonderful husband, and a wonderful daddy, and we're blessed, we're very, very blessed to have Dan in our lives, so I'm going to do that today, and hopefully have lunch with him.